How are things? Well, you know, from bad to worse. You know what I think? You know what I think about what you think? Was it you? Excuse me? Becky Levy. Did you report us to social? You know, Becky, people are dying while you were counting the 50s and 20s to keep their boys. So, no, I didn't tell social services to take him. I'm sorry, she's just... Was it you? What? You done it. Steve, you really need to get her an interpreter or a carer or something. Non comprende? You told them we paid for Max, didn't you? <laughs> it was her. It was her. She phoned social services. Asking me on a Monday, I say yes. Asking me on a Tuesday. Stop winding her up, Barlow. Oh, oh, well, that's a very nice way to speak to the mother of your one and only child. Two kids! He had two kids, I tell you! Oh, I know it was you! Let's get in the back it. now! She did it! She did it! Look, look, look at that smoke mush! But where's your <laughs> proof? You're just making things ten times worse. <laughs> Hello! Are you coming out here? Go away, Betty! Or do I have to come in? Hello! No! What are you doing? Did you not realise what she's done? It, it, it was her. <coughs> no. Go! What's going on out there? Ken! It's Steve. Listen, I'm sorry. Becky, put that down. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Whoa! Becky, engage brain. You swing that, and we will never get Max back. We will never see him again. Becky, just give it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Why not if you batter Tracy? No. Move. Steve, I don't want to call the police. Oh. Whenever we'll I have to. Get Tracy to do the dialing, Ken. She's never off the phone, that bitch! Dad! Keep hitting me upstairs! Amy! This is Becky McDonald. We've been tatty by to Max forever. Becky, you're insane! Yep! Becky! Now listen! I swear to you, it wasn't me! I'm innocent! Talk to the sledgehammer. Ah! Ah! Becky, oh, put it down! Ah! Leave us! Ken, put it down! It! Tracy, leave my daughter alone! She has cost me my son! It wasn't me! Somebody made you believe me! Becky, look, you guys better stay with Amy. I've done nothing wrong. I swear on Amy's life that I never made that phone call. You swear on anything. I swear on Amy's life and happiness! That little girl will be happy as Larry once you're six feet under. No, that's not true, Becky. Kenny, Please. I have warned you. Get out! Get out! <laughs> Leave us! Call the police! Oh, you just love that telephone, don't you? I bet you've got social services on speed dial. It wasn't me! You're a liar, Tracy! Now then, are we all feeling the fear, Becky? I swear that it wasn't me! That means no. I'm innocent! That blue-eyed four-year-old is innocent. You know what? He only stopped wearing the bed seven weeks ago, didn't he, Stevie? He got an aeroplane, a comic book and two extra stories. It wasn't me! What did you say when you finally got through to them? Hi! I'd like to report a kitty, please. He's loved, he's well looked after, and I'd like to blow his life apart. I said nothing because it wasn't me! Uh, <laughs> whatever! <laughs> because even if you fessed up now, I still have to put you to death! No! No! Hey, get off me! <laughs> 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 It was me! On Amy's life! It was me. I made the phone call. Sunday night. Phone box across the road. I did it. 